I'm really tired, but I wanted to update really quickly because today was my first day of work. Um, it went really well. I had about an hour of computerized training and then I kind of just got thrown onto the floor. And what I can say is, Kohl's is probably the classiest place I've ever worked. It's really nice. Um, it looks nice. It's so clean. Um, the people that work there are really nice and also very clean. I have worked with some unclean people. And it was really good. Um, I wore a brand new pair of shoes. Not a good idea. I have blisters on my pinky toes, probably the size of Manhattan. Um, I have blisters on the sides of my feet. Like, it's bad. And then um, I got to sit down again for another part of training. I don't really remember it, but um, I took off my shoes and when my feet were out of my shoes, my feet swelled up and I could barely get them back in my shoes when I had to leave for like, when I had to go do floor work for the last hour. I'm really tired. I couldn't sleep last night. I laid down about midnight. I was getting up at 6.30, so that was kind of meh. Um, but I didn't fall asleep until like 2 and nothing that I did. I don't know. It was really weird. I was thinking about moving and then I was thinking about like tattoos and then like my mind was just racing last night. Thinking about dogs, thinking about lots of things. Um, good news. Uh, Andrew and I were actually gonna, we were thinking about calling a breeder for beagles, but in my heart I didn't feel very good about, uh, buying a dog from a breeder before I went to the Humane Society. So we went to the Humane Society today after I got off work and we found a puppy. Um, she is a shepherd mix. Um, she's pretty tiny considering that she's a shepherd mix. She's five months old. They, they said that they think she's going to get probably about 50 pounds, maybe a little more, but I'll cross my fingers for 40. Cross my fingers. She's super sweet. She's like, you guys will meet her tomorrow. When she's here tomorrow, I'll pick her up on my lap and I'll show you guys. She's so cute. Um, her name was Eileen, which is my mom's name, which is kind of what drew me to her in the first place because Eileen's just win my heart. We took her out. She was really playful and sweet and, like, really um, good at interacting with the both of us. Like, when I said, come here, she came. When Andrew said, come here, she came. Sometimes dogs take to one person, and that's hard on the relationship. But she reacted well to both of us. She played with both of us. She chased both of us. She let both of us pet her. She cuddled with us. She kissed us. Well, I couldn't leave her name as Eileen because that's kind of awkward since that's my mom's name. No, Eileen, no. Stop pooping on the carpet or whatever. So I was like, I need to change her name. So she just looked like a daisy to me. And no, I'm not naming her after Daisy Del Hoya from Daisy of Love, even though I guess in the back of my mind that might have been it. But she looks like a daisy. You guys will see tomorrow. And Andrew even agreed, and Daisy's not really a dude name but she's not a dude she's a girl dog but um and I it was really cute I was like do you want to be a daisy and she started giving me all these kisses and I was like you are so a daisy so now we have little daisy Richardson in our family I'm so excited um we paid for her and she will be at the vet tomorrow we probably are gonna pick her up about 3 30 she's getting spayed and all her shots and stuff and I'm gonna make sure that I can get her parvo and Bordatella, Bordabella, Portabello, I don't know. But the shot so she can go to um, dog parks. Since we don't have a yard, I want to make sure that she can get her running out. Um, yeah, she's super sweet. There was another dog there that we really liked. It was a Catahoula. Never heard of those dogs before, but they look, they're hound dogs. They look very houndish, nose to the ground. But... This dog was very sweet, but it was so shy and timid and skittish. It took us forever to get it out of its cage. It took us forever to get it outside because every time we tried to pick it up, it just laid down. And we asked if it had been abused, and it was only five months old as well, and it had been raised in, in the shelter. Um, it just... I wish that I could have taken both of them, but the Catahoula just wasn't, unfortunately, wasn't the dog for Andrew and I. I feel, I feel so bad because I used to volunteer at the Humane Society, and I just always feel like 
little orphan Annie. Like, everybody wants babies. And unfortunately, I kind of wanted a baby, you know. And she's a baby. She's five months old. So cute. I can't wait to show you guys. Um, you guys are probably going to see probably every five seconds of her life. If you are on my Facebook or my live journal. Because I will be posting pictures all the time. I'm obsessed with puppies. Um, and now I have one, and I'm just so excited. We're, I mean, like, we don't move until Friday, so that means that we're bringing her here. But if someone tries to, I don't know, get sassy with me about it, I'll just be like, what are you going to do? Kick me out? I'm moving on Friday. And you would have to give me, like, to kick someone out, you have to give them seven days' notice anyways. So it's kind of like, try me, bitch. You guys probably think I'm, like, so popular because I'm always on MySpace when I do these things. And the, MySpace has this new chat thing that I barely even know how to use or work. And it's always like, bling, bling. And I noticed in my last video it kept going off and I was like, they probably think I'm so popular. But I'm not. I promise. Um, other than that, so brace yourself to be um, introduced to Daisy tomorrow. I'm so excited. I'm in love with her. She's so sweet. Um, I can't wait to buy her presents. I wanted to buy her a sweater, but Andrew said no. When I guess, I guess dogs are born with sweaters, so they don't need double sweaters. But I just really like, I don't know, she's going to be pretty big, so maybe she'll share sweaters with me. Um, anyways, so tomorrow you will be introduced to Daisy. Cross your fingers that her little vagina surgery goes well and she doesn't cry too much about her shots. She should be super mellow tomorrow because she'll still be kind of sedated. But I'm so excited. She's gorgeous. You guys, I wonder if you could see if I showed you the picture. Hold on one second. You are going to have to wait. Okay, I don't know. Yeah, that's not working. That's not working. Uh, oh, 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 there she is. You can barely see her, but she's super cute. Okay, this is turning out to be a really long video about this one puppy, but they'll probably all be about my puppy for a while. Okay, I'm super tired. My leg is swollen. My knee is acting up. I've been packing. Everything's gone. See my empty house. I'm so excited. Four more days and a puppy. Woo!